Hi, uh, here we are again, another week's gone by, and it's been a difficult one for sure. I don't even really want to be doing this right now, like at all. Uh, but I am, so uh, let's get to it, I guess, since there's only 10 minutes. Uh, Monday, um, I found out my therapy appointment got canceled and I had to reschedule it. So I don't see my therapist, uh, until the 23rd of this month, which was really disappointing, honestly. Um, it's, uh, kind of, uh, damage my optimism a bit, um, about, uh, how much, uh, of a benefit, uh, going to a therapist again will be, because, I mean, I still haven't even gotten to really talk to her at all yet, this was supposed to be the first time, but, uh, there's been issues along the way with that, this is the second time it's had to be rescheduled, um, Tuesday, uh, I did have the CT antenorography to try and figure out what's going on with me, and, uh, the test results came back saying that, uh, things were unremarkable for the most part, and while that would be exciting and something that I would prefer, like, I mean, I would prefer for there to be nothing wrong with me, um, I still have issues, um, with, uh, like, uh, my stomach and stuff and, you know, gastro issues, um, so I was really upset about, uh, that they didn't figure out what was going on because I'm still having problems. I mean, I would really love for there to be nothing wrong. Uh, but I mean, there's something going on because eating certain foods uh, causes big problems for me, among other things uh, that I don't particularly want to get into the details of in something open like this. Uh, at least not at the moment. Uh, I got my glasses, too, on Monday. Um, I was really excited about those, but, uh, when I put them on, they didn't seem, uh, like they fit my head properly. And, uh, when I went to try and talk to the, uh, providers about that, they said it was just the frames that I picked. And they offered me a refund or different frames, but, I mean, I don't know. I didn't really feel like it was uh, much of an option, I guess. Um, uh, along with that, too, when I put them on uh, and seeing my skin with the glasses on made me feel <laughs> a lot worse. Uh, that was really difficult, um, I still struggle with that, so, uh, those things were really, they really got to me this week, and I really don't like to be seeing things so negatively either, especially because of, uh, how much I got into, uh, law of attraction stuff, uh, for about a few years and how much it, uh, really actually pulled me out of the deep depression that I was in by, uh, seeing things as, uh, if, 
you know, your thoughts and feelings and beliefs create your reality. I really, really invested myself in that because I don't want things to be bad. Um, and if all I had to do was just believe that they're good, uh, I'd be grateful. I would do it as much as possible. Um, but some things that happened uh, around the summertime kind of really tested my belief in that. And while I do still uh, like the idea and do my best to abide by it, I'm... I guess a little not so certain anymore, uh, and I guess I just kind of allow myself to feel uh, and express myself a little more honestly about how the situations are to me. Um, Work was okay this week. I do love the people that I work with, and I think I have a great job. Uh, I, aside from that, I make minimum wage, which is a big issue. Uh, I don't. I really have the money to do any of the things I feel like I need to do that would improve my life, and it's a scary thought trying to figure out how I'm going to uh, ever make it. That's uh, that's something that could be talked about for a lot more than just 10 minutes. Um, this was uh, I guess it would be my second week on hormones, wouldn't it? Uh, my, I have enjoyed getting the some of the more subtle changes, uh, again, aside from a, a certain thing that gives me a great deal of anxiety and um, depression, and it's kind of almost scaring me out of continuing with this, but I also feel afraid of um, not going along with it and having to be masculine and live the rest of my life as a as a man, um, I feel like there's almost, uh, it seems like there's no way for me to get all the results I would like. Um, I don't really like SRS. I don't think it's, uh, an option for me. It doesn't really give the real thing, in my opinion, and I've read too many horror stories about it, so I would like to keep what I have, and the, what hormones have done to the that area of my body in the past, and what it seems like they might be doing again, really upsets me. I would like to have um, a healthy body, especially in um, that area, that more private area, uh, between a person's legs. Because I would like to be able to be intimate with somebody. I've never gotten to experience that. And uh, the atrophy to those organs that can occur on hormones is uh, deeply unsettling to me. It makes me feel like I might forever miss out on that. And that's something that I could talk about for a while too. So I'm really torn right now and scared and depressed and uh, anxious, and I'm trying not to be negative, but I'm really being tested, and I don't know what to do. Um, I wish I just knew what the right thing was to do, what the best thing was to do. Uh, it's almost time to stop. It's almost 10 minutes, so I guess I will wrap this up. Uh, I don't have any appointments this coming week, but uh, I do the week after with the therapy appointment I mentioned. Um, so I guess uh, thanks for watching again, and I'll see you next time.